<laughs> Welcome to the organization. Happy to have you. You stayed in the Midwest now. You're back in the States here for the Detroit Red Wings. How was that move from Minnesota to Michigan? It's been great so far. Uh, I've been here for a couple weeks. Uh, the drive's a little closer than Toronto, so it's nice. And obviously, like you said, you could stay in the States. I feel like Michigan's very similar to Minnesota, too, in a lot of ways in terms of the people are really nice and lakes and cabins and uh, the culture. So uh, for me, it's been a pretty smooth transition so far. Ole, you stayed in Finland for the summer. How yeah. was that? What were you up to in Finland? Not much, to be honest. It was uh, kind of boring, which I liked. I uh, <laughs> spent a lot of time with my family and friends. Um, I have a place down uh, in Jyväskylä. Nobody really knows where that is. Where is that? Yeah, explain it to like us. Right in the middle of Finland. Okay. It's actually a big city in Finland, but it's only 130,000 people. So that's What's really it like? Cool. Lots of lakes. It awesome. kind of looks like Michigan a little bit. Like, like upper, Minnesota. Yeah, like UP, like yeah. Minnesota. Yeah, yeah, a little bit. Yeah, that's why you guys are bonding. That's right. Big yeah. lake guys. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> but that's about it. A lot of saunas, lake. Mm -hmm. Spent a little time on a boat. But it was cool. That's yeah. awesome. All right, so we were talking about families. What are the makeups of your family? Um, siblings? Justin, do you have any siblings? I have an older brother and older sister. Uh -huh. uh, they're both still in Minnesota. We all live like within 10 parents. Or 10, 10, 10 minutes parents? Of my parents. <laughs> 10 parents of my minutes. Uh, 10 minutes of my parents. So they love that and we're able to see each other a lot in the summer. So it's great. But obviously when I'm here, I don't see them as much, but mm -hmm. still like to keep up as much as possible. And you kind of have a little family of your mm -hmm. own now, your wife, and then you guys have a little boxer named Franklin. That's correct. Yeah, he's my pride and joy. You know, he's uh, he's the best. He requires a lot of work, and he's got a lot of energy. Uh, but I wouldn't want any other way. Uh, so you mentioned you have a brother. Any other siblings? Or is it just uh, two older brothers. I'm the youngest. Oh, yeah. okay. Mom and dad. Uh, uh -huh. That's my family. I got my goddaughter living next to me. My basically my neighbor. Uh -huh. It's just. Uh, turning two actually next week. It's what a, a fun age. Yeah. Well, we all have our hobbies outside of our jobs, as you guys do, and that's something you guys bonded um, on tennis. Mm. Both big tennis guys. Is that just a hobby? Are you guys like watching it, just playing it? Is it something that you guys have really like dove into? Oli, or you want me to go? I think we're, I think we're the same, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dove in a little bit. Yeah. yeah for sure. Oh, you guys are like fully yeah. committed. For sure. Yeah. Wow, yeah. I like, love it. I, I love Oli because he's always down to play, and that's me. So like usually in Minnesota, all my buddies are like, you're crazy. But now I got a guy that's texting me all the time, and I'm like, this is perfect. Love you know? it. All right, favorite tennis player? Federer. Nadal. Oh. oh perfect rivalry. Oh, I didn't even know that. Perfect rivalry. <laughs> I've never played tennis. So I'm gonna need a lot of tips and tricks. I don't really know the terminology, I know a few things, but I'm gonna need your help with uh, skill-wise, so. No problem. What do you okay. say we hit the courts? Let's do it. Let's do it, all right. All right, so tell me some of the tennis 101s, the basic rules. What should I know to start? You have to win by two. If you're tied at three, it'd be called deuce. Yeah. It's 40-40, you call it deuce. Yeah, we don't want to be dropping any deuces on the court. Me and Ole have been dropping a lot of deuces lately, though. <laughs> Not today. <laughs> a lot. Oh, man. This is a lot. You guys do this for fun? <laughs> yeah, I know. You guys do this after work? I know, we're sick. You yeah. guys are crazy. Sick people. Coming to you. Oh. Home run. All right, so how do you serve? So it starts from this side. So on the right side of the middle line in that box, I'd have to hit it in that box. So you toss it up. Okay, you up. Oh my God. And you have to hit it. <laughs> Hard. You want to hit it? Sure. Yeah. Like. <laughs> Another one coming. All right. Not bad. <laughs> How do you hit it? Like, forward. I have to get one good one in. Yeah. All right. It's going to go in. We'll get it on time. <sighs> yeah. That's nice. Two. There you go. Oh! I think that's on us, right? We get hey. that point? 50 0. There we go. All right, fellas. I think it's time that you two show us what you can really do. I'm going to step out of the way. Well, I'm not going to crossfire. So, okay. Friendly trip, friendly competition. Just remember, at the end of the day, you guys are teammates. I love when the good news coming in on a day to day. Already know what's happening. I don't gotta shake the hay. Big moves, big step in the right direction. The trip continues. Every double use a psychedelic. The Europeans against the U.S. right now. Fellas, what's on the line? 
A lot of pride. A lot of pride. Good surf. See, that's a nice. I hate you only. Good Thank work. You. Yep, absolutely, Thank fellas. You. Thank you. Good work. You guys really killed it out there. I feel like I learned from the best. How do you think I did, though? My serve. I thought you were dominant. Yeah. You had a couple. Of, you had that winner. That was unreal. Oh, wow. You had a couple of good shots. I thought you were good. You can All use right. a couple more reps, but yeah. yeah. All right. Next year, training Next camp. Next year, for sure. Training camp. Let's do it.